Need for baby formula is only growing. Lawmakers are stepping in to help families, and the House is set to vote on a baby formula bill today that would make it easier for low-income families to buy the formula they need. The legislation would authorize the USDA to waive rules so that WIC recipients could swap one brand of formula for another, and they would be exempt from the maximum monthly allowances currently in place. Local organizations here at home are going above and beyond trying to help moms feed their children. Malini Basu visited one today in West Dallas. It's a struggle, you know. Despite the heat, Catherine Gomez and her three children lined up for hours, hoping to get baby formula and the necessities for her children. Pampers, formula. Especially formula. Financially, it's been tough for Catherine after her husband died. Of eight years, he passed away from COVID. As the sole provider of the household, Catherine, along with 400 mothers, lined up at Molina High School in West Dallas to pick up baby products for free. Thank you so much. It's thanks to Viola's House, a maternity home for homeless teenagers who understand the struggles moms are facing these days. Diapers, wipes, socks, bottles, essentials that mothers could need for their babies. As the moms are standing in line, Viola's House is handing out this card. There is an app right there. You got to download it, take a class and you get $10 and the moms can redeem it right here at this warehouse. Moms can redeem the vouchers for baby formula, but they have to earn it. Getting educated on parenting, pregnancy, an array of subjects. It's voucher based shopping with dignity. And many of the moms did the classes and went straight to Viola's House Baby Benefit Boutique in South Dallas. It is by request only right now because of the shortage. With the shortage in mind and a baby just days away. I'm just kind of nervous about that. Catherine is thankful that there is help out there. Everything will be okay. Just pray to God, you know, you'll get through it. In West Dallas, I'm Malini Basu.